morning. Steve Fried in Chicago with the morning grain comp. Got mixed trade right now with beans down uh, about two uh, two cents, uh, actually a penny, rallying from the low, uh, and now uh, trading the November around ten oh five. Uh, you still have pretty good carry between no and Jane. Uh, meal has bounced back to be uh, actually above Friday's close while oil is lower. Corn down two cents, wheat down nine cents. Stock market has turned lower. The dollar is lower. Uh, crude's rallied, but uh, uh, the rally is uh, somewhat subdued, whereas gold right now is a little bit lower. It was interesting. One of the big banks came out and said that gold at 2600 probably will trade as high as 2700 you know, as a hedge from an asset standpoint. Uh, with lower rates, uh, the gold can, can maybe outperform uh, interest rates or even uh, maybe even the stock market. Uh, the bet is that when the Fed um, does meet, that there's a 62% chance that they could uh, put rates down 50 basis points instead of 25 basis points. So uh, a lot has to do with uh, their interpretation, uh, not only of our economy, uh, but our jobs market and um, our whatever the inflation might be. Um, we also, from an outside market standpoint, see escalation and tension uh, in Russia and Ukraine. Also, uh, Israel, Gaza, uh, Iran, all of those things are, are maybe adding up. To, to more global tension. We did note that the uh, former president of the United States, uh, Donald Trump, uh, had another assassination attempt uh, with a shooter at, at his golf course in Florida. Um, again, uh, the polls are favoring Harris, uh, and again, none of her policies includes any increase in tariffs, uh, but it does include increase in taxes. Um, as far as weather is concerned in the U.S., we're warm and dry. Um, either early next week, um, there's probably some shower activity that might move into Iowa. Um, and we'll see uh, how you know much slowdown uh, of the harvest that is. But right now, the weather is perfect for harvest, and that should offer some uh, negativeness to the basis and also to spreads. Uh, the big key is will the farmer store as much corn as he can, uh, will he sell the beans? Otherwise, globally, uh, we're seeing a few showers in Paraná, but overall, South America is dry. We also noted in um, Central and maybe uh, Eastern Europe some heavy flooding. Uh, some areas in Czech Republic saw as much as uh, 20 inches of rain. Um, and then we also noted that uh, the first snow in the Sierra Nevada uh, in western U.S. popped up. And this is the first, the earliest they've been in 20 years. So our weather guy is trying to figure out for an analog year um, in which um, we could all, we could uh, figure out what might happen this fall and winter. We also had some heavy snows earlier than normal in the Alps. So all in all, choppy trade, uh, we're still in a kind of a supply market, which we have too much supply versus demand.